Commissioner Case, I didn't realize you were here, sir. Come in, Chief. I want to ask you something. Yes, sir. How many open files do you have right now? You mean the uh, case is under investigation? Mm hmm Not including the uh, Devane kidnapping? Oh, uh, few. Mm -hmm. What sort? Usual. Chief, I want to know exactly what this department has on its plate at the moment. Either you tell me or I'll check for myself. Yes, sir. Well, uh, we have um, two hit and runs and uh, disappearance and assault with a deadly weapon. Mm -hmm. All serious matters. Each and every one will be taken care of. When? Commissioner, look, you've got to understand that this is the most important woman of my life. She's the mother of my child, and I happen to love her. I assure you, Mr. Lavery, the department is doing everything it can to locate your wife. I appreciate that, Commissioner. Thank you. you couldn't ask for a better man to head the investigation than Robert Scorpio. I'm sure he'll find Anna in no time. Yeah, I hope so. Well, I have to be going. Good luck, Commissioner. Thank you. And, uh, Think about my advice. Port Charles isn't a small town. Priorities are important. But so is covering your bases. I know you'll get it all done. What do you want? This changed since I walked in here. Don't give me any riddles. I have enough mysteries in my life right now, all right? I came down here to help. I was going to ask you if there's something I could do, no matter how small, to help you find Anna. You were going to ask. I thought perhaps you and I, we could maybe settle our differences. We could unite over this one thing in saving her. Cut to the chase. Now I realize that that can be. Look, I really have no idea what you're talking about. And frankly, I don't give a damn anyway. I have an investigation to conduct and I have a woman to find. Yes, but not any woman, however. What's that supposed to mean? You know, I was so naive. I suspected, but I refuse to admit it. Look, could we discuss your personal problems some other time? No, I have evidence. Evidence of what? How you feel about Anna? I heard what you said to the commissioner, to Lewis. You said that you loved her. You've always loved her, haven't you? You never got over it. That's why you won't let me help find her. You want to find her yourself, isn't that it? That's ridiculous. And why should you want to share the acclaim and share the gratitude? Because it's my job. She's my wife. But you're determined to be the hero, the one and only hero. You want to be the knight in shining armor. You want to ride right in there. You want to save her. And who knows? The damsel in distress, she may be just so grateful that she'll take you back. No, I had no idea you were so emotional. I'm not being emotional. I am being realistic. You want to hog all the glory for yourself, isn't that it? You don't want to share it with me. You want to make me feel so small. So small next to the great Robert Scorpio. At the moment, you seem like a madman. You're afraid to let me join in the investigation in case I find her first, isn't that it? You're way out of line. Oh, am I? I know what I heard. You still love her, don't you? I know you admit it. And if I'm way out of line, then why don't you deny it? Go on. Tell me you don't love her. Okay. Okay, I put my cards on the table. I've wasted enough time here. I know exactly how to play this game from now on. I know you're scared. I know how sad you are, but everything's gonna be fine. I promise you. I'm gonna bring your mommy back. We're gonna be together again. We're gonna be a family. Maybe we'll all go together to Scotland. Would you like that? Hmm? I hope you can hear me. We're gonna be a family again, just the three of us. Nothing's gonna pull us apart. I won't let it happen. Nothing. I didn't expect to see you here. But you'd gone to the club. I did. I wanted to see you. So did I.
You didn't argue in front of her, did you? No, no, no. But uh, we've got to sit down and have a talk. This whole business has got to stop once and for all before it gets completely out of hand. This is not the time for you two guys to be at each other's throats. Can you stay here with Robin? Sure. Where are you going? Over to Duke's club. If he wants a piece of me, well, I'm just not going to play too hard to get. But let's find out where we all stand once and for all. Angel, would you help this gentleman unload this ship? You're stocking up? What do you want? Talk. No. You busy? Yeah. No. Not exactly. What's on your mind? We have to settle our differences. That's fair enough. Sir. Why don't we head back to my place and discuss it? Where do you want this? I certainly don't want it in here. Uh, please take it to the storeroom downstairs. My manager will help you unpack right. it. Business must be good. Yeah, I have no complaints. It's quite a shipment of something. What do you use so much over in? I'm sure you didn't come by here just to like discuss how I run a bar. What did you hope to find? What are you hiding? I don't have time to play games with you, Scorpio. I want to talk about Anna. Uh, it seems you're not happy about the way I'm conducting the search for her. Among other things. You got something to say, say it. Okay, it's perfectly simple. You're not a cop, you're a nuisance. Is that clear enough? You love Anna and you always have. This kidnapping is the perfect vehicle for you to try and get her back. I wouldn't be surprised if you engineered the whole thing yourself. You finished? Not quite. I know you intend to get her back. But that's not that easy. Over my dead body, do you understand? Now kindly leave my place, Mr. Commissioner. We have nothing else to say to each other. He didn't want to talk to me. He seemed nervous. Can you blame him under the circumstances? The man thinks he's trying to steal his wife. Still thinks I'm in love with Anna. 